Engineering videos and technical solutions, BTEC and master engineering thesis guidance, simulation of projects using different software such as MATLAB, PVSYS, Helioscope, ETAP, and many more. Detailed videos on these topics and much more available software such as AutoCAD, Revit, and SketchUp. Be part of our family by subscribing to our YouTube channel, follow us on Instagram, like our Facebook page, and visit our website. PZ Engineering. Passion to excel. Hi, welcome to the PZ Engineering channel. In this video, we are going to show design and simulation of 56.82 megawatt peak grid type PV solar system in PV software. Before we start with our simulation, if you are not yet part of our family, please be part of our family by subscribing to our channel, share our content, comment and like this video. You can join our membership team to have a special attention from our side, have access to our models and to have a guidance on your project. Grid tight PV solar system is a PV solar system that operates connected with a power grid. The operation of a grid tight is normal. PV solar system operates with a grid during the day. And here we have our you have a PV solar, you have inverters, you have our load, at the same time you have our grid. You can fit to the load and export to the grid. And PV solar system operates with a grid during the day. PV solar system is used to feed to the can be used to feed to the grid. And during the night, the PV does not supply the load and the grid takes, takes full control of the load. And it's normal use to reduce the electricity bill or to feed to the grid. How our system parameters is the size of our system is 56.82 megawatt peak. Solar panels is JA455 watt and number of panel 124,875 panels, and we have AC power of 50 megawatt which also is our inverter size. This is our PVC software. Now we can go to our grid connected. Here we have our new project name, new project name, we have our, our meter file. Then let's select in a new site. Now let's check. Let's check our our the address. Our address. Let's open this where we will be putting our plant. Wanna design from this area. Then let's check. That's the area. Let's open online. This is a Google Have Pro for us to be able to cope the area. This is the same area as we opened before. Now let's 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 cope our pin. Let's copy our pin and let's go and paste to our PVC and search. Now give us the area where we will be designing our plant. Accept the selector point. And then let's import. Okay. And then save. And okay. Say yes.
then OK. This is the same point. And then now let's save our project. Let's name according to F Masai. Then save. Then we are ready now to to build our system. Now let's go to our orientation. Let's put to tilt angle of 15. And as move angle of zero, it means the panel will be facing north. Now let's go to our system. Now let's take, as you say, we would select our, our size is 50. Is the area that you need? Just check the the area. You have one point eight million square meters. Or meter square. Let's go back to our PVC. Now let's. This is our J solar. Now let's get our panel. Now let's. We'll use SMA. Let's change the, the inverter size. Now let's increase here. As you can see, the inverter power is slightly undersized. Let's change the size of the number of in parallel now it's okay now you can see it's 4.8 kilowatt peak uh, and we need 50 at least let's increase the number of panels let's let, let's use our normal pv power to 50 megawatt Still need to increase. Yeah, that's better. Let's 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 continue for fifty. You know what? See, you know, model of in series twenty five and model is is four is four thousand three hundred ninety six. Everything here is okay. Number of we'll be using ten. Let's put it. Let's put it back to 10. Let's say, then I say OK. Then detail losses you can go through heat, depends on what type of losses that you want. You can modify them. So, any losses, any losses, auxiliary losses, engine, and ability, and the spectral correction. Can go around it, and then you have our storage. You don't need storage. You have our horizontal. You have near shading. We are not doing near shading. And our economic evaluation. Now let's run our simulation. Everything's okay. Let's run. Then let's go to the report. Here is our, you see our 50 megawatt peak, project FI, you have our project summary, you have a system summary, and you have a general parameters, the angle, and you have our PV array characteristics. 
number of panels, type of model, the type of inverter, total of inverters, and we have our 44 and we have our summary, we have our energy available, energy to the grid, the performance ratio is 84 point seven. And here are the tail losses. After running, now you can model the financial model, the economic evaluation. Here I have, you can change from euro to any or dollars or to any currency according to your country. You have our rates, you have our components, here we have our financial parameter tariff, financial results and carbon balance. You can just put the rate of each, each model, each parameters, monetary structure. based on the, the price in your country or in your market where you are designing your system. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, share our content, comment, and like this video.